Hi guys, today I'm going to show you the top 5 design tricks for your app screenshots to increase your downloads, so stay tuned. So there's lots of stuff that you can actually do with your screenshots in order to get attention from the user that visits your, your app store page and make sure that your app sounds so appealing that they're going to download it. So today we will have a look at the top five things that you can do right now in order to improve your app store screenshots and to therefore get more downloads. Pretty cool, isn't it? Videos are definitely a way to increase your downloads. There was a study that has been done, so I've done a little bit of research as well on this topic as well because I wanted to know some stats. A study was done on the top 100 apps in the App Store and it turned out that 30 of those 100 apps have actually a video on their App Store page. So videos increase your downloads. Now, if it is a game, it makes perfect sense to have a video because you can give a little bit of a sneak peek of what the user can expect from the game. But even if it is a photo editor or a social media platform, communication tool, whatever it is, a video will help you to convince whoever it is out there that will look at your page to download the app. Obviously, they will download it if you hit their pain points and you find a solution for that. But that's another story. So, video. Remember, video. Okay, video is the first thing. Second thing is clear communicating one message per screenshot. Rather than trying to put a lot of text on your App Store screenshot, have your app displayed on the screenshot and potentially some text if the screenshot itself isn't self-explanatory. What a beautiful word. Basically, that means have a two-liner, maybe with a heading, which is a keyword potentially that sucks in the user's attention and explain one feature or one benefit of the app. Third thing is design. Make sure that when you design your screenshots, App Store screenshots, and you, if you include text, that the text is easy to read, your message. So normally what I do is I check the screenshots on different devices, you know, a small iPhone and a huge iPhone and so on, just to make sure that it's easy to read, that a message comes across. And you can do that by obviously large font sizes, but also keeping your background very plain or have a big contrast between the text and your background. So let's say you have a black background and a white text, there couldn't be more contrast. You know what I mean? Another thing is keep your screenshots vertical because that enables you to show more stuff on your on your screenshot. You don't want the user to like, yeah, it's just keep them vertical. And finally, prioritize. Prioritize your screenshots. So upload five screenshots include a video if you can and the first two screenshots if well if you have a video the video should be first if you don't have a video the first two screenshots are the most important screenshots so another study showed that most users well most people on the app store 60 percent are not scrolling further than the first two screenshots so you want to make sure that your message and the most important feature that you have to offer in your app is displayed 
on the first and on the second screen. If you're not sure about that, there's a little trick that you can do, which is called testing. You can test what feature is most liked by your target audience by simply using some Facebook ads. So put a little bit of budget into Facebook, take your, take your screenshots and your messages that you would normally include on the screenshot and basically push out an advertisement which goes to the app store for downloading. But what you can do, so if you test all your five screenshots, for example, you can see which message, you know, has the best conversions to your app store. So that's one way to test it. Let's make it very practical. I'm gonna get my phone, we'll have a look. Uh, I will take you through the user experience of what it will, what it is like to search for a keyword and then decision making and looking at the different apps that are displayed and what they do in order to draw in our attention. Hi guys, okay, so I opened um, the app store now. What I'm going to do is I'll type in a keyword. Let's say I am looking for a photo editor and there's a lot of stuff that you can do to improve your SEO. If you're interested in that, then let me know in the comments below. So basically what I mean with that is SEO, improve your SEO is in order to be more visible in the first results. So there's a lot of stuff that plays a role in this. If you want to know more, let me know and I will make a video on that. But for now, we're just plainly focusing on the App Store screenshots because that's the video for today. So what we see here is some, and you can see here, by the way, the first two screenshots on an iPhone Plus are displayed. So that obviously also, again, shows the importance of the first two screenshots. So this is what I will base pretty much my decision making on because I can click right here. I don't really have to read much. So you want to make sure that the most important message, most important feature that is used and loved by your users is displayed on this screenshot on the first and second one. So let's have a look inside here in this one. So as you can see here on these screenshots, it's a large text with a good contrast, so it's very readable. They kept it short, which is good. I don't have to read much. I can understand what's happening here. Children photo editor, well, I'm not sure if that messaging is the best messaging. So maybe recharge for best looks. Now that's, that's very interesting. That's a super, I, you know what, I actually would have definitely change these around anyhow so that's an interesting feature effects for pictures that's really cool and here you can see even though the text itself isn't really you know if you were saying effects for pictures it doesn't really say much but because you have here the screenshot which explains what the effects are that's a very good way to showcase your feature or functionality of the app. So now with that one, I'm already intrigued. I really like this, that's cool. Now let's have a look at another app, this app for example. Here we go, there's a video. So as I said, videos are fantastic for conversions and basically what these guys have done here is they give a preview of how you would use the photo editor to edit your photos, which is fantastic. So love that. That would make me want to download the app right now. And I probably will do it because they got some really amazing effects. So that's awesome. And here we have, you can also see on those screenshots that there is some text which explains the feature. And then you have a screenshot of the feature. These guys made the most out of the space. They took the screenshots without having an extra background which you can see here for example it's really up to you how you want to present it, it also depends on your brand if you choose this type of template that helps you to use the background for some information and text let's have a look at this one here again you can see it's very the text itself is very short it's a clear message there's only one feature that you explain on the screenshot 
we got a good contrast and a very appealing screenshot of the app itself. And these are the two most important features for this app. You have a collage editor and you have 5,000 layouts. Again, how would you know which screenshots are the most important ones? As I said before, you can do some Facebook testing, but you can also do testing on the App Store itself and basically have for one week just flip the screenshots around, like the order, and just test per week different order and you'll see which screenshot is more appealing to your audience, which increases your downloads. If you're still here, good on you. Thank you for sticking around. And because of that, I'm going to reward you with one more tip which is if you design your app store screenshots before you even start check out your competitors basically type in the keyword look at your competitors study the screenshots that they're using look at the features that they're presenting on the first two screenshots as well download some of those screenshots put them all in a folder put your screenshot in that folder as well and see which design drives the most attention that's one thing that you can do, but also be very clear in your target audience. You may have seen in the screenshots that we quickly had a look at, they are very, very differently. Some are very funky and cool, others are very classic. So it's all about what target audience you're after. So always keep that in mind. This is marketing 101 right now, guys. Make sure that the design of your App Store screenshot appeals to your target audience. And again, Nothing holds you back from testing, so throw out some Facebook ads and test which screenshots are the most appealing to your target audience and which give you click-through rates to the app. And that's it for today. High five for making it all the way through the video. If you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel so you can get a notification when I upload a new video, which is about how to videos, practical stuff for your business, for your startup. There will be a podcast in a few days again where I sit down with the founder and we'll talk about their business. Lots of learning in there always. So make sure to subscribe. Also, let's start a conversation. Leave a comment below and we'll have a chat if there's anything in the video that wasn't very clear or where you would like to have more information. Let me know and I will create a specific video on that just for you so let me know and that's it for today have a beautiful day and i will see you in a few days hopefully Up, tricks ux id uh, and now let's have a quick look in the app store to see if i was right or wrong or i don't know ah, 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 so many arms okay what the top top apps doing ah. and that will I don't know I will see you I will see you I'll see you right now ah. by improving the design of your, of your app store screenshots such a long title <laughs>